solving equations involving indices. Now, before you've watched this video, you should by now have watched the Laws of Indices video. And you're asked to solve the equation 3 to the power of 2x minus 1 equals 27. Now, the problem here is that not both of these parts are powers of 3. And that's what we need to do first. We need to make this 27 a power of 3. Now, if you're asked a question like this in the exam, you need to look and think, what number can both of these be a power of? And that will help you start the question. So, in this example, it's quite nice because we know that they must both go into 3. Sometimes they're not as nice. Sometimes they might give you two numbers. And you have to make them say powers of 2 or powers of 3. So, how can we make 27 into powers of 3? Well, 27 is 3 cubed. So, we can rewrite this question as 3 2x minus 1 equals 3 to the power of 3. Now, because both sides contain the uh, common 3, we need to solve basically the powers. So we're going to solve 2x minus 1 is equal to 3. So this difficult looking question comes down to something quite simple to solve. We add 1 to both sides, so 2x equals 4, so x is equal to 2. And if you substitute that 2 into the original equation, well, 2 times 2 is 4, minus 1 is 3, and 3 cubed is 27. So that works quite nicely.